Tonight on Way 31 News at 5, hospitals across the U.S. still feeling the effects of Hurricane Helene as Hurricane Milton makes landfall, made landfall earlier this morning here at home. Huntsville hospitals dealing, delaying rather non-emergent surgeries due to a shortage of IV fluid. Their distributors factory in North Carolina damaged badly by Hurricane Helene. Way 31 reporter Paige Meyer spoke with Huntsville Hospital today to get a closer look at the impacts of the shortage. Paige. Marie, the president of Huntsville Hospital says that this shortage is simply unprecedented. Now, the IV fluid company based in North Carolina is the main distributor for the country, distributing more than 60 percent of all IV fluids. Now, this damage to their factory is so extensive that no one really knows when things will go back to normal. Huntsville Hospital is only receiving about 40 percent of their normal IV fluid supply. That means as of right now, the Huntsville system is only doing what they deem to be top priority procedures, including urgent, emergent and cancer cases. Some non-emergent surgeries that are displayed include orthopedic, urology and gynecology surgeries. Now, the hospital system's president and COO said this shortage will not impact the quality of care for their patients. I can assure you, if somebody needs surgery, 100 percent, we will do it. If a doctor says, hey, XYZ needs the surgery, it's urgent or emergent or life-threatening or cancerous, we will do it today. No questions asked. Huntsville Hospital is working right now to find new sources of IV fluids. Now, I'm told the Alabama Hospital Association reached out to both the White House and federal agencies for them to take immediate actions to help with this IV fluid shortage. For more updates, stick with Way 31 News. Reporting live in Huntsville with coverage you can count on. Paige Meyer, Way 31 News.